Hey everyone. Let's just assume that we are building a project which required a microcontroller paired with any other electronic PCB. And we need to put them together inside a box or a casing. In my case, I have to connect a microcontroller with an DC to DC converter and a MOSFET setup in order to switch a load. For that, I put everything together and made the setup. But wait. Isn't this setup a little oversized? Yes. Well you can't put Arduino Uno inside this small box so using it is irrelevant. So what should we use instead of Arduino Uno? Well we can use Arduino Pro Mini which is the best choice when it comes to project like these which have limited space and needed to be compact as much as possible. So I bought a Pro Mini and replace it with Arduino Uno. So after soldering it to the setup, I noticed something. Where is the programmer in this thing and how can I program this board? In order to program this board, we need an FTDI programmer. Which I didn't buy, so how the heck we can program this Arduino Pro Mini without a programmer? Solution for this problem is quite simple. We're going to use Arduino Uno to program Arduino Pro Mini. But how? We gonna use the TX and RX lines of Arduino Uno to program Pro Mini. So let's get started with our tutorial. First, carefully remove the Atmega IC from this board, be extra careful or your Uno will be dead. Next thing is to connect both of the board together with jumper wires. Connect reset of Arduino Uno to ground. TX of Uno to TX of your Pro Mini and RX to RX, VCC to 5 volts of Arduino Uno and ground of Uno to ground of Pro Mini. Just follow this schematic and you'll be good. Now you need to connect the Arduino Uno with your PC and open Arduino IDE. Set the IDE for using the Pro Mini board. Go to Tools and select your board which is Arduino Pro or Pro Mini. And then, hit Upload. And it's done. We have successfully programmed a Pro Mini without using FTDI programmer. Now carefully put the Atmega IC back on Uno and try to upload a sketch. And as you can see, Uno is still working. Now go and make something cool with this board. But before that, hit that subscribe button if this video was helpful and smash the thumbs up button. Check out my other videos. Stay creative and I will see you next time. Adios.